West Virginia versus Texas. Interesting spot. Texas, a nine and a half point favorite the week before Red River. A uh, total of 63. It's at 7.30 p.m. Eastern time on FS1. And why don't we go on and pull up the sheet here so that you can see what we're looking at. Uh, Texas, again, nine and a half point favorite. I've got them by 12.03. Uh, West Virginia's defense is not great. Uh, they're, they're decently stout against the run. Uh, number 28 in stuff rate. Uh, if you look at that as far as uh, West Virginia's defense goes, the offense, uh, West Virginia's offense, pretty good uh, as far as running the football. But Texas's defense, again, pretty stout against the run. Uh, number 39 in offensive line yards. They're number 23 in PPA per rush. Only number 81 in stuff rate. And West Virginia's offensive line is number 30 in stuff rate allowed. So that's something to uh, keep an eye on here. Um all these player-only meetings and whatnot that Texas has been doing this week, does it mean anything? Does the game mean anything for them uh, heading into next week? That's what I'm curious about. Because I, I am concerned that they may not care about this West Virginia game, but after losing to Texas Tech last week, it, that might have gotten their attention. That's, that's what I'm going with. I'm going to take Texas here. To cover because I think that the way that they played last week gets their attention for this week. Heading into the, you can't go into the Oklahoma game with three losses. You just can't do it. So, so yeah, I think they'll cover. Um, I mean, it's under 10. You've got the hook here. Yeah, I'll take it. I will take it. Give me the Longhorns to cover nine and a half. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.